We're out on a job site here this morning. The homeowner called us with a problem. She said she was having trouble flushing her toilet. And actually that's the simplest symptom that you can uh, look for in a septic system failure. So we contacted the health department and they came out and did a soil sample, gave us a recommended system, design, and uh, size. At that point, um, we could then give the homeowner a uh, estimate for the job. So here we are, we're beginning the job today. And the first thing we need to do when we begin a job is locate the uh, sewer line where it exits the house. And then we're gonna run a, a new line from the area that where it leaves the house into the new septic tank, and then we'll place septic tanks. And in this case, we're gonna be putting dry wells in. And so we'll take you through the whole process. So here we're determining where we're gonna place the tank. And there's many different factors that are involved in determining what kind of a system you put in. Okay, we found the sewer line here and uh, we've cut the pipe. The, actually, the, the pipe that was laying here was just up and down. It wasn't a good grade, so we're gonna replace the whole section until we install the tank. But first, we're gonna install a clean out here so that if you ever have trouble in the future, you can uh, get a roto rooter and clean it out. up the laser here because we need to determine proper depth for the tank and what I'm doing here is trying to determine where the bottom of the tank is going to have to be in order for this pipe to go into it. Now that we have the dry well set here you'll notice there's about a foot of space around the uh, diameter of the dry wells. And that's the absorption area of a dry well system. And what we're gonna be putting in here for the absorption area is uh, rubber chips. Uh, this is an approved method that we use in place of septic stone. Okay, why don't you uh, flush your toilet and uh, let's watch the flow. Okay, we've got a flush and it's going. Jackpot. <laughs>